Hey guys, welcome back to Cosmic Skyblock, where today what I want to do is mainly get our auto rabbit farm set up, which will then become an auto cow and chicken farm. But for the time being, I think we'll focus rabbits. I want to get some coal nodes because they're going to shoot up in price at some point. In fact, they've already started going up a little bit, so I want to get them before they really skyrocket. I want to get cow spawners and I want to get the carrot recipe because I think we're nearly, we've nearly harvested enough potatoes to get carrots. In fact, I think once I've harvested this lot, that should be enough. And the way we're going to do this, if you haven't already noticed what's in my hand, is paying to win. Because paying to win is always better than grinding, let's just be honest. Um, so, yeah, whilst I sell these, I will try and remember other stuff I've done off camera, but I don't think there is that much. Oh, actually, no. Chickens. I have killed enough chickens to get cows, which is why I want to get the cow spawners going ASAP. And it's another reason I want to get the coal nodes and carrots, because they will help me get to level 30, which I need in order to actually get the cow spawners. So, whilst we're selling these uh, chickens, whilst we're selling these cosmic slot bot things, I'm just going to make a cut, because I don't entirely know how long it's going to take to sell them. Hopefully it goes pretty quick, but it could take like an hour. Right then, so we finally managed to sell all our slot bot tickets, so we are ready to start building the the uh, grindy thing, I, I still don't know what to call it, the spawner thing, yeah, but anyway, depending on the size you want it, I'm not entirely sure how big this is going to be, because I can't exactly build any further this way, because I'm at the world border, speaking of which, I wish there was a feature that let you, like, actually there probably is, but I don't know about it, but, I wish there was a way that you could see your world border, like, as in, like, so, like, your island world border, that would be so good, because then you'd know where you can build and where you can't build, and it makes it makes so much easier. Because this it might get bigger in the future, depending on if I can be bothered to make it bigger in the future. But for now, this is... all I'm saying that. Now, why don't I just make it bigger this way? Why didn't... I, yeah. Because then it, I can make it bigger, and I don't have to make it bigger in the future. There we go. So that's like... That's a bit across. So what we're going to do now is get our dispensers out... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Perfect. Then we need to fill the... Yeah, we'll fill them with water later. But basically, what we now... Oh, no, I de I'll definitely need more redstone. And speaking of redstone, I haven't actually just said what you need, have I? So basically, you're going to need some blocks to build on. You're going to need your grass blocks for them to spawn on. You're going to need anvils to stop them from... Um, well, I say them. It's The anvils are mainly for the rabbits. Because I think with slabs... Rabbits can actually go underneath the slabs, so they obviously won't stay on the magma blocks, which then kill them. You're going to need repeaters. I'm not sure how many you're going to need. I've just got ten because that should be enough. You're definitely going to need more than four redstone, like regardless of the size. Because obviously you need to put it, you need to put the redstone over the dispensers. And then you're going to need a redstone torch to start it. Collect, ideally collection chest to like get the loot. And then I think... That's everything. I mean, obviously I'll need the um, the spawners, but I mean, that's a bit obvious because it is literally a, a spawner grindy thing. So what we're going to do, quickly buy up some more redstone. Honestly, I'll just buy a stack. A stack will do nicely. And then we are going to put this... We're not going to put it over there because I need to get my island level up. Um, island upgrades. There we go. Ability to place redstone. Hoppers, anvils... There we go. Now I can actually do it. I completely forgot about that. So you want redstone across the top. You want redstone there. You're going to need redstone in the corners as well. Because obviously repeaters can't go around corners. At least I don't think they can. And then basically... Oh wait, hang on. Yeah, no, the pulse the pulse can go this way. I don't think it matters which way the pulse goes. Um, I'm, I'll just buy some more repeaters. Why not? I was going to say I'll spread them out better, but I'll just buy more. I can't be bothered to pick them back up. There we go. And then, that is basically the pulse done. It's literally as simple as that. And with this many repeaters, you shouldn't really need to play around with the settings, but... I mean, it's 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 kind of obvious, like, the pulse you have it. Like, it's not too quick, but it's not too slow either. I, I, you'll you'll probably, like, I mean, when I did the first one of these, I did. It was, it was pretty obvious, like, what setting to have it on. So you'll probably understand straight away when you build it. But then what you need to do quickly is do... Oh, damn, I forgot about that. Um, do it this way. That should be all right. Then you put that there, and you put your torch here, and that will start the pulse, which I didn't think about. Um, wait, why is it not? Why have I what have I done here? 
I've done this wrong, haven't I? How have I done this wrong? Hmm. Yeah, that's what it should do there. Why didn't it do that the first time? Did I do something wrong? Yeah, that's... Oh, hang on. That's what it should do. Look, it pulses around. Yeah, no, I will... That's way too quick. So I, I will actually need to play around with the settings on this. Have them all... At, it's it's broken again. Um, Hopefully this isn't like a theme and... Hopefully this spawner still... This grinder thing still works. But yeah. We'll, you know, we'll put the pulse in later. So let's just do that for now. And then you obviously want to put your grass in. So you just get... I suppose it depends how big you want it, really, because I could realistically have it that big, and that would be fine, because what we're going to do is have it so this pushes them, like, down to a, like, down to a, a channel sort of thing, and then they're going to get brought down to, like, roughly over here, which I'm not entirely sure is 100% great, because if I'm remembering rightly, there is... Like, there's something to do with the splitting of stacks. Like, because obviously they spawn in, then they pu they're pushed away, and then another stack would spawn in, and they're pushed down to there. I think that's what you want to have. But I could be wrong, to be quite honest, because I'm just building this off memory. So I'm going to continue to build the majority of this. And then I'll just cut back once I've got, like, the grass and all the, all the tedious stuff out of the way, pretty much. Right then, so after many years of losing brain cells, we've finally built it. And don't ask me why I've done it like this, because the answer is, I'm an idiot, and I didn't realise that this is as far as I can build outwards. So, it has it has to look like this. I mean, in the future I can probably change it, but it's unlikely. Let's just be honest. So, final touch is to add that, and then we yeah I did I did change the um thingies, but do you know what that should that should actually be all right. I think it might be a bit too slow but as long as they get pushed into there and then they flow down here then they should get pushed into this eventually and the reason it's three this way is because obviously having it like this I'd, they probably wouldn't spread out very well so if say a rabbit is here and a cow comes along the cow can push the rabbit down to here and the cow will still be um still be cooked so it should work and if we go down here, it should be collected. I mean, I was going to say, it might not do it yet, because obviously... It is definitely in the definitely in the chunk, so it should be fine. Um, but obviously, the, the drops are going to be really inconsistent, pretty much. So, it might not start collecting for a little while. But the good thing is, it works. Although, saying that... Is this stack just going up? Let me, let me just watch it for a second, because I think it is still going up, and it's not far enough away. Oh, no, 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 look. There we go. So, hang on. Oh, no, they're still there. Yeah, no, no, yeah but look, it, 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 it is working, I think. So, that is good. So, let's go and see if it's worked. No, it has not. I'm just going to assume it's taking its time. So, let's go AH. And we need to look for a carrot recipe quickly. You know what? Actually, is there any deals on rabbits? What a deal. 10k. Because in the shop, I could buy two of those. Why? I still don't get why people... Like, are people... I'm... Um, not trying to be harsh or anything, but are people genuinely stupid enough to buy that? Like, like, like genuinely, are people actually stupid enough to say, 10k, that's a pretty good deal for a rabbit spawner, I'll buy that. Because they can't be, I'm sorry. I, I'm, I'm genuinely not trying to be harsh, but they can't be. Just can't, unless you don't know enough about the game to know there's a slash shop, obviously. When in, in that case, it's not really your fault, it's more sort of not knowing the game. Because honestly, that is something I would do. If I didn't know anything about Cosmic Sky. So I suppose I can't really say that much. Chicken spawner. That... I wasn't meant to buy a chicken spawner there. I would just like to point that one out. Um, I'll put that back. Oh, oh cow spawners as well. I wasn't meant to do that either. Hang on. A-H. I'm really losing... No, I don't want to do that either. Uh, I was really losing trade. I'm trying to find a carrot recipe, aren't I? And I've just completely got distracted. 900k! We're not buying it for 900k. I saw them in the AH for 400. We're not buying 900. I'm sorry. I don't get how much I need carrots. We're not buying it for that. Also, it has just occurred to me. No, no, I'll do it now. I was going to say I'll sharpen it up off camera, but it doesn't take long to do that. Uh, so what do we need now? We need, we need, we need, we need our coal. Yeah, oh, they've got up as well. I literally saw them for like 70k. Now the question is, are they going up 
because they're just actually going up or are they going up because there aren't any cheaper ones if that makes any sense as in people just aren't buying them because they're too expensive um really bad timing on my part eh? uh cow spawners cow spawners cow spawners you see i've seen so many cow spawners for a decent deal like like two cow spawners for 50k it's not an insane deal but it's basically buy one get one free and now there aren't any why am i so bad at just everything oh look, it is working though that's good um well then isn't also good i'm not yeah i'm gonna have to like start afking here aren't i just so i can like fire them huh what about what about iron what about iron nodes you see 100k a piece i swear they were like 70k i've really messed up and it's not even my fault i'm just unlucky right then um no i i, I want to buy even if i have to wait like another hour before i can buy some i'm buying some today I just, regardless yeah it seems no one wants to sell me anything for a good uh, a good deal and i think the problem with that is basically the time it is now is like a really unpopular time like in, in a couple of hours like loads more people should be on so hopefully that's when the deals will start coming through what are they? i thought they were baby rabbits for a second um but yeah hopefully i'll be able to get some nice deals on coal and like cow spawners and stuff then but i did actually manage to get 15 spider spawners for 9k a piece which i think is an absolute banger of a deal because aren't they 100k a piece I literally just got them for ten percent of the actual, the actual price, which is insane. So we cannot complain about that. And I did get, what was it? Was it Netherwart? Netherwart. I got that for like hundred and ninety k, I think, which is, I think it's pretty good because I'm expecting that to go up quite a lot in the future. Oh, that's really triggering me. There we go. That's better. Um, that's did I? I think I got some. I got something else, didn't I? What else did I get? I'm certain I got something else. Oh no, I did something else. I did this. I made this more like a filtery thing, so all of it will filter down here. I mean, not really necessary now, considering we've only got, what, 20 rabbit spawners at most? Not exactly necessary, but when we get more rabbit spawners, it will be useful. Although, saying that... Oh. I mean, I'm not going to do it now, because I don't really see the point of doing it now, because it's not. we're not efficient enough to do it, but... What I'm going to do in the future is definitely make this an auto cooker. Because obviously then I don't need I don't even need to take it out and then ferry it over to here. It'll, it'll literally it'll just do it itself. Which will be def it will definitely be good. So we'll probably change how this looks in the future definitely, but for now it's it's good because I, I'll just sell hand the raw rabbit and it should give me it'll give me some money. It won't be great, but I mean for the time being that's what we need because we just need some some income because I can't keep paying to win. As much as I want to, I can't. I just, I just can't keep doing it. So yeah, hopefully tonight. Oh, yeah, also speaking of which, I can't actually mine the coal yet. Is what I've just realised because I still need to get like a hundred and something more of these mined. So it's not exactly a big deal anyway because I wouldn't be able to do much with them. But hopefully tonight we will get some a good deals for like seventy k because there's no point of buying them now for like one hundred and twenty five k a piece. When in like five hours time they're going to be 75k a piece. Because I've just wasted 50k. And that's like, that's two thirds of a coal node. So it's a pretty, it's a pretty big waste of money. Also yeah, I did do this. I, I completely forgot to mention it. I mean, I'm sure you saw it, but this is where they're going to go. All the coal nodes, the iron nodes, diamond nodes. Just the nodes are going to go down here. Except from these nodes. They, they'll probably get mined up at some point. Because I won't need them in the future. Also that is my uh, cobblestone generator. Kind of forgot to mention that, but it's a bit irrelevant because it's a cobblestone generator. Uh, so yeah, I'm pretty sure that is everything that I've done. Still haven't actually mined all these to get carrots, but... Nah, I don't really need to do that now. I might as well just get this finished because I've already started mining it. Right, there we go. So that is it for the episode. It could have been a short one because no one wants to sell me anything, which is a bit of a bummer, but is what it is. So... We'll wrap it up. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Also, I don't know if I mentioned this in the last episode, but if anyone has any like tips and stuff on how to actually be good, they are greatly appreciated. So leave them in the comments, please. Um, so thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed and I will see you next time.